Hey, 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 what up, guys? It's your boy, SoFlySoJo1, and today I'm gonna be showing you guys the treasure hunt in order for you guys to get the Golden Revolver and $250,000. Now, this is particularly for the new people who has not unlocked the Golden Revolver yet that's possibly new to the game and just starting off. Now, you guys are gonna get an email from VanderLine at iCandy.com, and inside that email, it's gonna contain a photograph, and you guys gotta use this photograph to identify the area on which this target of the treasure is going to be located and now you guys got to figure out on where that location is now once you guys open up that email a big yellow circle will spawn on your map randomly and my circle is right here in this little area right here this is one of the locations your location may be different now once you guys are in range of that big yellow circle you guys will be looking for a white note okay you guys are going to be looking for this white note and my location is right here now my letter happens to be posted up on some kind of log and it reads treasure tore our family apart and ain't here no more i moved it you fuckers would never find it okay so rockstar doesn't really tell us much about this but once you guys read that letter a treasure hunt will pop up and you guys gotta go investigate all three uh clues around the map now go on the map and you guys should see three question marks on that map and you guys gotta go to each and every one of those clues. So as you guys can see, our first clue is right here. Our second clue is right on over here. And then our third clue would be somewhere over there to the left on the map. Alright, you guys can see it from a far distance. Right on over there. Okay? So now we're on our way to investigate our first clue. Artificial love, we just make it all. Okay guys, for our first clue, it's going to be somewhere over here in Grapeseed. It's going to be parked up next against a tree. And you guys are going to find yourself a golden revolver box. Now once you guys walk up to this clue, you guys will press right on the D-pad and notice that it will be a missing gun imprint along with six bullet imprints. And it will be right here located on the map, right over here in Grapeseed. Now there it is guys, your first clue. On to the second clue. Okay guys, and for our next clue, it's going to be right here north of Sandy Shores, right over here on the beach. And you guys will find a little shack right here. Now you guys are going to go right on inside of the shack and you guys will notice a nice bloody shovel. Alright? A nice bloody shovel for you guys. That is clue number two. All right. All right. So from the looks of it, this dude has my family. He's gotten a gun and he's he's got my family. He must have buried him. Hit him over the head with a shovel and now it's all bloody. This is great, guys. All right. On to clue number three. Let's go. All right, guys. On to our third and final clue. It's going to be right on over here in Tongvo Hills. And you guys will notice a cave, all right? You guys are going to approach this cave. You guys will notice a guy in some underwear, okay? Go right on up to this drunk dude who's laying in a cave. And go and press right on the D-pad. And you guys should receive your third and final clue. Damn, man. I'm surprised he ain't got shit stains in his underwear. <laughs> Rockstar should have definitely put that in the game, man. Now, once you guys have collected all three clues, the treasure should be appear on your map go and check your map and you guys should see a big yellow box on your map go run on over there and mark it on the map and we are going to grab our treasure now for me the location of the treasure is over here in richmond Glen. it may be different from you guys Now once you guys arrive at the spot, you guys are going to see a bunch of dead bodies and you guys are also going to see a treasure. Alright, inside that treasure box, you guys should see the golden revolver. Go right ahead and press right on the D-pad and go and claim your prize. Ooh, look at that bad boy. It looks nice, gold, and shiny. Right, guys? Alright, you guys worked hard for it. Appreciate it. It's a free gun after all in the game. And Rockstar does not like to give us anything in the game for free. Instead, they like to charge us for shark cards. <laughs> Rockstar likes to charge us for shark cards, guys. Put it like this, I have never bought a shark card in my life. 
Never. Never will. Never have. And you guys can see on why I have never bought a shark card before. Because if you guys go over to my channel, you guys should see all my videos that I have. Showing you guys ways of how to get massive amount of money in GTA 5. Now once you guys have gotten the Golden Revolver, there's actually a challenge you guys gotta do. You guys gotta get 50 headshots with the Golden Revolver in order to get an additional $250,000, alright? Now you guys do not have to get 50 headshots on players that are in the game. You guys can actually do this with NPCs. I'm gonna show you guys on how to get 50 headshots with NPCs really quick. I'm gonna be showing you guys an easy way on how to do this by doing a little wall breach here. Alright, so go on over here where I am. Now you can do this solo or with a friend and what you guys want to do is you and a friend come on over here in this little glitch spot and start up the most wanted challenge all right now what's gonna happen is a bunch of police is gonna surround you now go right ahead and get 50 easy headshots with these police officers now while you're doing this this will be better with a friend so your friend needs to register as a CEO and I say that it would be better with a friend because when you are an associate of a CEO, you will gain additional money for being a CEO associate. And you guys will also gain additional RP as well. So make sure you guys are an associate of a CEO of a friend's CEO, okay? So that way you guys can gain that additional $250,000 on top of all the money you guys are getting for being an associate of a CEO. Alright guys, once you guys are done getting 50 headshots with the Golden Reviver, you guys will notice that you guys will get $250,000 once the challenge is completed. This footage that I used in the video is not the correct footage. Uh, this footage right here is with the Navy Reviver and I actually got $200,000 from the Navy Reviver, right? But it's the same concept, alright guys? You guys will get $250,000 for the Gold Reviver. And if this video helps you guys out, please hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on all notifications. It's your boy, SoFlasoJo1, and I'm out. Peace.